Hey friends, today we are hanging out at Disney's Hollywood Studios and we're going to be meeting up with some friends and going to an epic lightsaber meetup later on tonight and I am so excited. I'm also looking to buy my very first lightsaber here tonight so I can bring it to the meetup and just have an amazing day at Hollywood Studios. Anywho's, let's go do this. Today is March 26th and it's going to be a very busy day here at Hollywood Studios. They have been sold out of park reservations for like the past three days and I was trying all morning to get a reservation for Hollywood Studios and I was lucky enough to grab one. Technically, I wasn't even able to get a Hollywood Studios reservation. I was only able to get an Epcot one. So the only way for me to be able to come here to do the lightsaber meetup was to drive to Epcot, touch my magic band, and then immediately leave and park hop over here at 2 o'clock. Honestly, though, I don't mind. You gotta do what you gotta do. And now that we're in Hollywood Studios, let's take a look at some of the wait times. Rise of the Resistance is 115 minutes. Smuggler's Run is 75 minutes. Toy Story Mania, 60. Slinky Dog Dash, 105. And the Tower of Terror with the longest wait of the day, 140 minutes. That is crazy. Don't get me wrong, I absolutely love Tower of Terror, but I would never wait 140 minutes for that. I mean, let me know in the comments, would you wait 140 minutes? I mean, if it was like a once in a lifetime trip and this was the only time to ride Tower of Terror, then I probably would wait. But like if I was just down here on a week's vacation, oh man, 140 minutes, that is a long time. That's longer than Rise of the Resistance. We're going to make our way straight back to Batu because like I said, I want to buy myself my very first lightsaber. Last time I came to a meetup, I had a friend who had an extra one who let me use it so I didn't feel left out and I swore the next time I came to a meetup, I would have my very own. I can't believe it's taken me this long to actually get my very own lightsaber. Like, I've done Savi's workshop, I think, three times. I built one with a friend, I built one for a friend, and then I did one and I gave it away for charity, but I never got one for myself. Now, I don't know if we're going to be able to do Savi's because I don't have a reservation. So we're going to look into that and then also maybe one of the legacy lightsabers to see what they have, you know? I'm hoping that some of the wait times go down a little bit later on so we can ride some rides. We might find ourselves back here at Star Tours. You never know, I do love a little Star Tours. I just recently got back from being aboard the Galactic Star Cruiser and I feel so let down that I did not purchase the exclusive Legacy lightsaber from there. I mean it was so amazing and I loved doing the lightsaber training aboard the Star Cruiser and I just I should have got it. I should have got it. It's going to be so amazing to see hundreds of lightsabers all lit up later on tonight. And the last meetup I went to, there was even a Star Wars celebrity there. So you never know. You never know what could happen during these meetups. I just checked at Savi's and there's no walk-up reservations. And I keep on checking the app just in case because I would preferably want to build my own lightsaber. But at the same time, there are some very nice legacy lightsabers that I do like. But uh, I, like I said, I gotta have my own lightsaber for the meetup. So if I end up having to get two lightsabers eventually in the future, then I will do so. Well, this is a little bit of a surprise and a setback. It seems I might not be able to purchase a lightsaber today. So Savi's has no reservations and I wanted to go into Doc Ondar's here to purchase one of the legacy lightsabers, but they're not allowing anybody else to go in. It's at capacity for the day, they said. So I don't know what to do and I asked if I can buy a lightsaber anywhere else and they told me no. So I don't know. I, I, I guess they said maybe try back a little bit later on tonight, but I guess I'm not going to be able to get a lightsaber. I might be out of the loop, but I didn't know this was a thing. I didn't know. And it's all my fault because I didn't plan. I didn't plan accordingly. If you fail to plan, you plan to fail. And that is what happened here today. But I'm going to keep high hopes anyway because you never know. You know, some magic might happen and uh, maybe they'll start allowing people back in. Or it might score one of those sweet sobby reservations. Since we can't get a lightsaber at the moment and my friends aren't here, I think we'll go grab some lunch and, like I said, keep trying at Savi's or wait to see if Doc Ondar's opens back up. And uh, I think I have a pretty good spot to get lunch. 
I was thinking about getting a Ronto wrap and then I was just like, you know what I can go? I can go for some good sausage and peppers. And I was like, I wonder if anywhere in Hollywood Studios you can find some sausage and peppers. And I checked Pizza Rizzo out and they have a spicy Italian sausage and peppers hoagie. What are the chances of that? So I think we're gonna go to Pizza Rizzo. As I was walking over to Pizza Rizzo, I found a really awesome photo pass opportunity where you can actually take photos with a real lightsaber. Too bad I can't buy one, but look, at least I get to take a photo with one. Very fancy. Oh, you're welcome. Go ahead and get your Sith Lord face on. <laughs> Am I not supposed to smile? <laughs> It's fine to smile because it confuses the enemy. Oh, that's true. Uh, no. Very well. <laughs> Can I do a, a serious one? Yes, one serious All right. One. I don't know if that's serious or not. <laughs> <laughs> How awesome was that photo pass opportunity? I love that, right? It, 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 like you said, they had all different lightsabers there. They had uh, the dark side, they had the light side, and uh, it was kind of cool. Another really interesting thing is the Italian sausage here at Pizza Rizzo, where the spicy Italian sausage is plant-based. So we're gonna be trying some plant-based sausage for the first time and comparing it to what a uh, regular Italian sausage would be. You know, I think it's gonna be a little fun. I'm also going to be taking you guys up to probably one of my favorite places to sit down and relax here at Hollywood Studios. All right, now we got our food. We got to head up to the second floor. We're going all the way up. Usually there's nobody up here. Oh, look, there is nobody up here. Got the whole place to ourselves. Look at that. Fancy. Once you get upstairs, you want to go all the way back and down to the farthest door and inside you're going to have your own private wedding reception or prom, either way. But this is really cool in here. Wait till you see this. Whoa! It comes with a little dance floor, some music, a disco ball. Before you go, go. And here it is, the plant-based sausage with some carrots and a cup of water. It looks really good. It's got marinara sauce on there. It's got some peppers. I can't wait to dive into it. And I love being up here. There's going to be some amazing music getting played in here. Oh boy. The party's beginning. <laughs> wait, we got to eat our sausage first and then we'll dance. And then we dance. Here we go. Look at this in here! <laughs> and this is amazing. It doesn't even like taste like not, or it doesn't even taste plant-based, let me say that. And it is definitely a little spicy. I really like this, this is really, really good. The bread is perfectly toasted. You can hear a little crunch in there. And it's not that messy. You know, I, I thought it was gonna be a very messy thing, but it's not too bad. You just gotta squish it down a little bit. We're right in between a song change. <gasps> it's a slow dance. I don't know how much of the dancing I'm gonna be able to leave in because you know we're gonna get copyrighted for this music, but I'm having a good time. <laughs> this dance is for you. I like the fact that when the slow music came on, the uh, disco ball actually slowed down. Look at that. It got all quiet. Okay, well, that was an emotional slow dance with a hot Italian sausage, and uh, I'm okay with that. But, by the way, that sausage was amazing. Like, if I could find the manufacturer of that, I'd eat it all the time. It's plant-based. I didn't even know. It, didn't, it did not taste plant-based. And uh, I think it's time to carry on. Time to move on out. While we are up here, I want to show you guys the best restroom at Hollywood Studios. And it's back here. 
on the second floor of Pizza Rizzo. Like I said, you just take the stairs right on up and then come in the door and they have restrooms that are above the Royal Flush. And uh, there's not gonna be a single person back here. There's nobody up here, seriously. Like, I don't even know, people don't even know to actually just like take the stairs and come on up. That blows my mind. But yeah, here's the restrooms. Not a single soul up here. Enough of the sausage business though. We need to figure out what we're gonna do with this lightsaber ordeal. I did hear that they do sell lightsabers at Tatooine and Traders, so I might peek in there and see what they have. They're not like the best, they're not the legacy lightsabers, but uh, we'll just take a look, see? I ran into my friends and we're gonna do a lightsaber photo here. Adam already has a lightsaber right there, look at it. That's Luke's li uh, lightsaber. Luke's legacy from Return of the Jedi. Oh, wow. That's nice. Oh, you can hear it a little bit. Is that cool? Nice. So we got Adam, and then we got Danny, 702, Ryan, Splorn, Ryan, and you got... I got the Darksaber. The Darksaber. Very fancy. This but now... $20 uh, Darksaber. I like it. And now we can uh, actually get a proper photo with all those lightsabers. Well, here it is, Tatooine and Traders. So we'll see what kind of lightsabers they have in here. This is basically the uh, gift shop to the exit to Star Tours. And uh, they said they do sell some. Hi, friends. <laughs> and take a look at this. They got lightsabers in here. And these are the legacy lightsabers. These are $220. And they have Luke, they have Vader, and they have Mace Windu up there. And it's kind of cool because these come all packaged together. So you get everything and then you get a little stand too. Look at right here. I think I'm gonna go for it. I mean, this is everything all together. And I do love Mace Windu. I like it, I like the purple one. Oh boy, a decision is gonna have to be made here. A $220 decision. <laughs> Isn't she lovely? I can't wait to break it open. We're gonna go sit down and I don't wanna get it all like messy right now. I kinda wanna take my time in putting it together, but <laughs> I'm excited. All right, so I'm going to unbox this actually right here in the park. Gotta be a little fancy. Oh, oh. Ooh, it actually pulls out just like this. I might not be able to do this with one hand. I seriously love this. I'm actually a lot happier that I purchased it this way. I love the fact that it's got a nice stand there. Look at that. Instructions to put it together. We'll take this bad boy out right here. Oh man. This is too good. <laughs> I am very happy. I can officially say I have my very own lightsaber now. And I love it. I really do. Look at this. Woo! <laughs> and I love Mace Windu too. So like this is perfect. I was thinking about just getting Darth Vader. But when I seen Windu's in there, I kind of always wanted his. You know what I mean? And now I'm just, I'm, I'm very happy. <laughs> I'm very happy for this. I know that there's a lot nicer lightsabers out there that you can buy, but for this being my first lightsaber, I'm very happy with my purchase. I'm happy that I got it here at Disney, and I got to open it up in Galaxy's Edge, and I got to bring it to a meetup, so it's more about the journey than the lightsaber itself, and today, I'm very happy with my journey. And it's starting to get dark out, so we're gonna see a lot of lightsabers appear, and it's gonna be fun. Adam is looking at getting himself a Jedi robe, and I think it fits you perfectly. It's like, good. It's an extra large. Yep. I love it. Impulse there boy, right there. Oh, there we go. This is the way. <laughs> so of course I have my lightsaber here, and then I ran into a friend, and he has a, the same lightsaber. Well, not the same lightsaber, but the same color. And look at the difference on camera, even. And that's a NeoPixel, right? Sure. Look at that, though. 
That looks so much better. Yeah. This is the one that I bought in Disney here. Right? Amazing. Wait, can you power yours off? I'll power. Look at it. Oh, wow. And then power yours. Oh, what? Oh, wow. How much do you think something like that costs? This is about like 300, what, 320? 320. Not too shabby at all. <laughs> the hardest thing I have to say is trying to control myself from turning it on and off because I don't want the battery to die before the meetup. But I just love it so much. I just keep on doing it. <laughs> As you can tell, some people are starting to show up already. Like I said, there's going to be a lot, a lot of people. Last time I was here, easily 500 people. So I'm shocked. I'm very excited. There's somebody that's walking down that has, I think, like 15 lightsabers in his back there. Do you see that? Right there to the left of Adam. <laughs> he has a lot of lightsabers in his backpack right there. That's a Neo Pixel dark saber. This is what I was actually at the droid meetup. Oh wow! You were uh, you were a man. You have the same one. Oh wow! I love it. <laughs> so before we were talking about the difference between Neo Pixel and Disney, and now this one right here, the the yellow one, that's a Zia Zena Pixel. Xena Pixel. Sub-tier of Neo Pixel. Wow. It's basically Neo Pixel and Disney Sabers combined. It's basically in the middle. So basically you, so basically you have like a legacy saber, Xena Pixel, Neo Pixel. Well, I'm gonna guess the brightness of it possibly. Well, I'm loving that one. I'm <laughs> <laughs> right? And then we got, <laughs> and then, and then we got, we got Florin. <laughs> the half pixel. It's so fun learning about the different lightsabers and also seeing the different lightsabers in action. You can really tell a difference. Like, you can see, you can see where the quality is. Dude, this is too sick. Look at this. Yes! Wow. <laughs> I ran into another person. What is happening? Look at your lightsaber compared to mine, though. I might. No, yours is cooler. Oh, but that is amazing. Wait, you have a YouTube channel. What's your channel? I do have a YouTube channel. My channel is Carly King. Carly King. All about Star Wars, All right? About Star Wars, vlogs, mostly Star Wars. Mostly Star Wars. But, you know. Yeah. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. Well, I'm excited for the meetup, and I'll put her link in the description too. But a lot of fun, like a lot of fun creators just having a good time, right? A lot of nerds. Yeah, in we're all here. Way. The best way. <laughs> it's getting down to the last couple minutes before we all actually light up our lightsabers and start to pose. And look at all of the lightsabers. Some of them on, some of them not on yet. You got to conserve that battery. But there is a lot happening here. And there's still a lot more all the way over on that side. Let me point with my lightsaber. <laughs> I ran into Maria with LBV TV, and she actually has the Galactic Star Cruiser training, the lightsaber training uh, lightsaber. It's so cool, it changes color. Look at that. So it goes to yellow and green. That so is too cool. We duel later. Oh, I love it. That is I'm awesome. So excited. This is yeah, this is it's starting to it's really starting to turn out here. Look at this. <laughs> I can download. <laughs> it's like I'm like <laughs> I feel like I did that some reason. I just practiced that. Yeah, you know, just took it from the back side. Ah. Ooh, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> the victor. Ice TikTok. No, Ice TikTok. I like it. I'm here for the chips. You're here for the. I like it. <laughs> here for the chips. All right. It looks like we're lining up now. I'm also here for the saber meetup. I spent just as much. Wonderful. Look at this.
And props to uh, my wonderful camera crew here. Happy birthday! Nice! Oh, wow! You don't look it! <laughs> well, cheers! Have fun! <laughs> oh boy, now it looks like we're going dark side, light side. But where shall I go? <laughs> dark side! Look at it! <laughs> nice! <laughs> Like yeah, green. this is too good. Wow, I love it. <laughs> Wait, oh, oh. <laughs> you're overrun. You're overrun. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Force push. Yeah, force push. Force push, push back. <laughs> wow. Okay, let's kick the blade oh, away. We literally started hitting you. Ah! <laughs> hey, I haven't hit you yet. Let's see, Bruno. You don't know what that is? We're all going to push our codes into a center point. Center points. This is crazy. This is, this is crazy. Now we're moving over to the Falcon, so all the Blue Sabres have to head out. Look at that. Blue Sabres are calling by numbers. Now look at this. The sea of blue <laughs> They're separating everybody by the uh, color of their plate. So this is, this is like the, uh, the Jedi for the green. It is. It's Look at, look at the line of blue sabers. There's a green one. There's a green one. Go top of that person. A green snuck in. There goes Adam. Now they're calling green. You and two other people. Here comes the white sabers now. White Sabres! Purple! Purple. <laughs> Holy moly! Hi friends! <laughs> Look at this. Look at the color coordination happening. Red, purple, white, yellow, green, blue. This is so cool. Look at how amazing this is. Look at how cool this is. Amazing. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> there we Chris, go. can we get those fine folks and pull them back? Starting, starting with the guy with the three saber bags. Beautiful, man. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> So they're now doing individual group photos with either yellow or white and before they did blue and green and then they're going to do red and purple but if you can see there's about eight purple lightsabers and that's it. There's eight of us here right now. 
I think one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Oh, you got blue. <laughs> and with that, I think we are calling it a night here. A night night. The park is closed. The park closed at nine and it is past 10 o'clock now. And we're still here just hanging out, taking some photos. But I hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. We'll see you next time. Bye. I'm so excited to see how Gracie is going to react to the lightsaber. Gracie girl. Gracie. Come here. Oh, nope, 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 nope. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh, yes. Ooh. Ooh.